what's up guys uh, i hope this video finds you well welcome into pendadi's other video um today i will show you uh, because i wanted to show you all the installation for um i would say mb server but now i think it's a good time to show you also the different clients and one of the clients I wanted to test for you is the Fire TV client. So basically the MB, uh, the MB, uh, Fire TV client. So let's do a little test because it won't be long. Uh, the advantage of MB is that you have the same, um, the same client interface among all the different devices you can use with NB. And it's, uh, it's making the process very, very, very easy. So let's say, okay, let's, uh, let's my Fire TV trying to connect, trying to update itself. But uh, you will see that it's super easy. So on the Fire TV, uh, I won't show you this part because my MB client is already installed. Uh, but on the, on the Fire TV, you have like, uh, the, the, the kind, a kind of app store, okay? That's a kind of Android store, Google store, whatever. You can go on the store, you look for MB, and you will find this, uh, application here, right here, okay? So it's super easy to install. It's like any other application. You just have to say, install the application. It will, appear uh, magically on your, um, I would say on your Fire, Fire TV uh, dashboard uh, home screen. You launch the application. After that, you have like uh, a portion of setup to do. Uh, on my side, I have, ah uh, yeah, I have two, because I have like two uh, server here. So I will connect with this one here. It will be easier. So you have to, con to select the server you want to connect. And uh, yeah, because it's Halloween, so every everything is orange. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> um, so you have to, to choose the server you want to connect to. And um, also after that, you have to choose the user you want to connect to and to remember the password you put and put the password. So you, you will get there. Um, I already showed in the, in the last video, um, I showed you, uh, this kind of interface. So it's not a different, a completely different interface from, uh, the other, uh, different clients. So it's not something that you have to learn again. And again, it's super intuitive. It's, uh, easy. It's a very easy to use. Uh, let's say I want to watch like, Walking Dead, I'm coming here. I have all the information needed and I just have to play like season one, episode one, and I am going to season one, episode one. And at the bottom, I have like access to a complete OSD so I can change the, the language during the during the playback. I can have a button here to change some settings like the quality, the display mode. If I want to change something here on the display mode, like putting 60 FPS or 59. So if you want something smoother, it's 59. Uh, I can change the zoom, the zoom. So basically it's like adapting the, the picture to the, to the fire TV or the the display, I would say, uh, repeat if I want to repeat the episode. Uh, playback correction, I don't know exactly what is that, but playback error is a current item exhibit. Exhibit a playback error, like no video or audio. Okay, no. I can just, uh, going forward in the rewind. So basically, I can do anything I want. Yeah. So it's good. It's a good, good client. So I'm going back, going back again. And, uh, if I'm going like, um, here I can, I can see that the working dead is still in progress. 
and I didn't finish it. So I'm going here and I say, oh yeah, I want to come back and continue my, my playback and I click and that's it, it's, it's coming back. It's super easy, super fast, super intuitive. Um, uh, yeah, so I can go more. I can add to favorite, to queue, or I can go to show also because I want I want to go to go directly on the Walking Dead uh, series because I want to see like I don't know like the actors for instance. Oh, Norman, Norman is here, so I want to see where Norman has played. I have all the movies he he played before or he was involved in the TV show and also like the different episodes he was involved in, you know, so yeah, definitely it's a, it's a good client. So I hope uh, you enjoyed the video. Um, I just wanted to give you an overview of the, of the Fire TV uh, client. Um, stay tuned because I have a lot of stuff uh, coming. I'm doing a lot of videos for you guys to share the knowledge on uh, technologies in general, on NB, on, on everything here. Uh, so I will recommend you to subscribe to my channel. And um, I hope you have a good day. Thank you very much. Bye-bye. See you on the next video. <laughs>